There will be no Triple Crown down the line in the Belmont Stakes after Exaggerator's three-and-a-half length victory in the Preakness Stakes at Pimlico Racecourse on Saturday. After four losses to his Kentucky Derby winning opponent, including a second in the run for the Roses two weeks ago, the son of 2007 Preakness winner Curlin turned the tables under Hall of Fame jockey Kent DeSormo in 158-31. The win was a first major classic for trainer Keith DeSormo, as well as for the partnership of Big Chief Racing, Head of Plains Partners, and Rocker O Ranch. Keith DeSormo did say Exaggerator will continue to the Belmont, and trainer Doug O'Neill said a Belmont run could be possible for Nyquist off his third, behind runner-up Cherry Wine, who also will head to the Belmont, according to trainer Dale Romans, along with Brody's Cause, who was seventh in the Derby. Now one update on a runner who got a ride home in the equine ambulance. After finishing sixth after pressing Nyquist's pace, Uncle Lino had slight filling in a left tendon but could have walked back to the barn. He was just given a ride for a precautionary measure. We'll have updates on his condition at bloodhorse.com as well as all the additional news coming off Preakness Day. You can always follow us on Twitter for continued updates as we head down the road to New York and the Belmont Stakes.